Agreers, disagreers, all my chum out there, welcome back to Agree to Disagree, and this is my review for The Imitation Game, which is a movie with Ben the Cumberbatch regarding the first computer during World War II. And it's okay. It, it, there's nothing wrong with the movie. The fact is, it just seems very serviceable. And it seems like it's just made to win an Oscar or, you know, get nominated for Oscars. And that's it. I mean, it told a fine story and definitely one that I wanted to know. I'm glad I know the story. But ultimately, the movie itself is pretty forgettable. I mean, going forward, if I remember the story, I'll, I'll remember, oh, a movie told me that. I won't necessarily remember the imitation game. It was very... Just nothing really stuck out going forward. Everything was fine, but nothing really stood out is pretty much what I'm getting at here. It felt like every other Oscar bait movie that we see every year, and it just didn't warrant really anything above or beyond that. Uh, the acting was great, Ben the Cumberbatch was great, although pretty much just played similar roles to what he has in the past. That's why I wouldn't really say the acting was, you know, the best thing ever, because Ben the Cumberbatch is good, but... Like I said, he, for the most part, he seems to be playing the same kind of roles, and there was no exception here. Everyone else was fine, too. The acting was great. Uh, the writing was great. I mean, everything was, was great. I mean, it was fine. It's just really nothing stands out. And when it comes time for, some, for the Academy Awards, and you know this will get nominated, I don't see what will make this the standout or the front runner or anything. It just really, it seems very forgettable in that regard. And I would say ultimately that's in the directing. I feel like with a, a different director this could have been handled much better and could have gave us something else. Um, not saying the directing is bad, just lacked style, I would, I would really say. Um, lacked the desire for it to be more than it was. And that's pretty much my main problem with it. Everything else was fine. It, you know, I, I can go on about cinematography was good. You know, everything was fine. The fact that it lacks style and everything is really its greatest problem in my eyes. But that's pretty much all I can say for the Imitation Game. I mean, I can keep going on, but I pretty much, I got my, my point across. There's really no need. Um, let me know what you guys thought, though, of the Imitation Game. Uh, do, do you see it winning anything? I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Subscribe if you takes around this much effort to do so, and let's see if we can agree to disagree.